Hi everyone, it's me again, I, and welcome back to my channel. From the title of this video, may i-review tayo ngayon na isang set na skincare product from the Go Glass. So if you want to know my thoughts about their product, please keep on watching. A little disclaimer lang guys, uh, we all have our own skin type skin condition, um, level of sensitivity, level of oiliness and everything. So my review will be based on my own experience. Naging reaction talaga sa skin ko. Honest to goodness review tayo. Hindi dahil padala to sa akin na aking kaibigan na reseller ng Glow Glass na si Clang ay puro positive na yung maririnig nyo sa akin. Hindi po. So kung ano yung talaga na experience ko with them, yun po ang isi-share ko sa inyo. So, let's start with the brand, the Go Glass. Nakita ko sila on Facebook. Dahil nare-post nga sila ng aking kaibigan na si Clang. She's from Quezon City. I will put her, I will put the name of her Instagram shop dito sa screen. So, DM nyo na lang siya if you're interested to buy, if you're interested to try their product. So, the Go Glass, uh, meron silang dalawang set. They have the resurfacing set for only 370. Ang sabi dito, your skin remedy that will help remove pimples, gently removes dead skin cells, blackheads, helps reduce oiliness, hyperpigmentation, and most skin problems. And then, etong set na i-review ko for today, ito yung brightening set nila for only 450. A glow booster facial set that helps skin retain moisture. Skin becomes brighter, firmer, helps lighten age spots and post breakout. Acne scars and minimizes pores, hydrates, and gives radiance to your face. So every set meron siyang apat na inclusion. For facing set meron siyang soap, um, toner, serum, and skin shield or yung pinaka sunblock nila. And then yung brightening set nila, na i review ko for today, instead of soap, meron siyang brightening bubble mask lens, right? I think. Let's start with the price. For me, sa halagang 370 or 450 na meron ka ng apat na um, product, hindi siya pricey. Talagang pasok sa budget ang presyo nila. And then sa packaging nila, as you can see, very simple, very straightforward and minimalist yung kanilang packaging. And dito lahat yung ingredients sa, sa likod. And yan yung pangalan ng product and yung pangalan ng brand nila. Ang hinahanap ko lang dito is yung manufacturing date and yung expiration date nila. Sana na ilagay din nila sa mismong bottle. Kasi nas, I think nasa box yung manufacturing and expiration date nila. In my case, na nasira na yung box sa shipment. Pagdating sa akin, sobrang sira na siya. So, tinapon ko na siya a month ago. So, ayun lang. Kana po sa mga nagawa ng skincare product. Ilagay po lagi natin yung expiration date sa lalagyan niya. So, now let's proceed with the effect of the product sa aking balat. A little disclaimer lang guys, it doesn't mean na hindi nag-take effect sa akin ay hindi, niya mag, ay hindi na mag-take effect sa inyo. Or it doesn't mean na effective sa akin ay effective din sa inyo. Lahat po tayo ay may kanya-kanya skin type, skin concern, level of sensitivity, etc. etc. Hiyangan lang po iyan. So let me start with the brightening bubble mask cleanser. This brightening bubble mask cleanser claims to hydrate and illuminate your skin after masking. The fast-acting cleanser that instantly dissolves dirt without stripping the skin. It protects your pores and whitens skin. This one is a no-no for me. Dahil sa unang paggamit ko sa kanya, nag-react po ang aking eczema sa mukha. At first, medyo hesitant na akong itry itong bubble cleanser na to. Kasi basta gel-based, basta gel-based na cleanser or foam cleanser hindi talaga ako hiyang. Nagra-react talaga yung aking eczema. And, ayun nga, hindi nga siya hiyang sa akin. It's a no-no for this one. Next is yung brightening toner nila. This one, nakahiyang ng aking balat. Nakahiyang ng aking eczema. Hindi siya nag-trigger. Kaya masasabi kong mild siya. On in-between skincare maintenance toner, it controls break breakouts, improves skin texture, and lightens the skin. Every other day ko lang siya ginagamit or twice a week. So, if you have sensitive skin and gusto nyo mag ng bagong product, gradually, dahan-dahan lang, huwag nyo agad 
yung buong set ng regiment niyo before and then mag-change kayo bigla. Mabibigla din ang skin niyo and possible magkaroon ng negative reaction ng inyong balat. So for this one, it's a thumbs up for me. Next is itong favorite product ko sa brightening set nila. Ito yung kanilang serum, Go Glass Serum. It claims to help skin retain moisture. Skin becomes firmer, smoother in texture, and make pores appear smaller. It helps lighten age spots and post breakout acne scars. Ang naging benefit naman sa akin ng, ser ng serum na ito, again, sa aking pores. And ito yung nabigay sa akin ng glass skin na kinaklaim na kanilang brand na uh, that it will give you a glass skin na hindi, hindi siya shiny because of oil. But because healthy siya and Jewish siya and plum, so ito yon this one. This is the first serum na nakahiyang ng aking skin. And I use this like three times a week before bedtime. But last but not the least is yung sunscreen nila or yung the Go Glass Skin Shield in SPF 30. Wala siyang PA++. It helps prevent sun damage and skin cancer but also works to neutralize harmful free radicals try this once or twice but after an hour sobrang nag oil up yung aking skin kaya sobrang oily pa naman ang face ko so sad to say the go glass skin shield it's a no no for me If you're going to ask me if Mara recommend ko ba sa inyo ang product ng The Go Glass, definitely yes. Sa price range pa lang nila, sobrang reasonable na. Hindi ka manghihinayang dahil sa isang set meron ka ng apat na product. Pero depende pa rin sa inyo, preference nyo pa rin yan. Ang naging review ko ay base lamang sa aking sariling experience. Kung meron kayo tulad ko ng mga eczema or skin allergies, Better to consult your dermatologist first, your skin doctor first. Kunin nyo yung ingredients online and then ipakita nyo sa kanila sa inyong doctor if okay sa inyo, if safe sa inyo. Kasi ako, I tried it on my own. I took the risk. And wag nyo gagayahin yun. Better if you have skin problems like mine, eczema or psoriasis or skin asthma, much, much better if yung mga gagamitin nyo sa inyong balat, ay tatanungin nyo muna sa inyong dermatologist or sa inyong doctor. If you're going to ask me if I'm going to repurchase this set, kung sana magbebenta sila ng individual product, definitely a yes. I-repurchase ko dito yung serum and yung toner. But as a set, siguro I look for someone, a friend na who have dry skin kasi tingin ko makakasundo niya yung um, sun shield yung skin shield ng the go glass at yung bubble cleanser nila overall okay naman yung product sa akin lalo na siguro kung wala akong eczema and skin allergy sa aking mukha sigurado makakasundo ko silang lahat it really does the work for me dahil napansin ko yung mga nagsisigaw ang kumpor sa ilong after a month, hindi na siya sumisigaw. Nagbi-whisper na lang siya. <laughs> and then, sa akin, shakes. And yung sinasabi nilang glowy and dewy skin, glass skin, nakikita ko naman siya na yes, dewy yung skin ko, not because of oil, but because of the moisture na binigay sa akin no serum and ng toner. And I hope someday na they can sell this separately para do sa mga tao na tulad ko na nakahiyang lang yung isang product or yung dalawa or yung tatlo, they don't need the cleanser or they don't need the sunblock, ganun. So, yun lang naman. And still, thankful ako dahil may nakahiyang ko sa kanila. So, yun nga guys. I hope you've learned something from this video. So, if you have questions, suggestions, or comments, just leave it down below. <laughs> I 
I forgot to mention guys, mabango ang scent ng product na ito. Sobrang mild lang ng rose scent niya, hindi matapang sa ilong. Yun lang and thank you again for watching. See you on my next video. Bye!